Now at 6, Rockford is continuing to support their Ukrainian sister city of Brovery as they are now in the midst of hosting 10 teenagers and their chaperones from the city. 13 WREX's Emily McMahon was able to meet some of these young people today and she joins us live now in studio. Emily, what more can you tell us about this visit? Well, Brittany, the Brovery residents arrived Friday night and have spent the past few days exploring Rockford, including the new library downtown, the UW Sports Factory, and the Coronado Theater, which is where I was able to meet them today. These young people shared more about their experience in Brovery and what it means to be able to travel here. Maria Zimoschlock has spent the past five years living in Brovery, experiencing the current conflict firsthand. Every day alarms and uh, I can say rockets, right? But we get used to, so it's, uh, we're not scared of that. Chaperone Olena Korovina echoes that statement, but says as a member of Brovery City Council, she feels she has no choice but to stay. Last week, uh, we were awake uh, in the middle of night because of the sound of explosion and uh, my window was uh, um, nearly open. Along with living in a country in the midst of a war, Jamoshlok's father also passed away as a result, leaving just her and her mother. Pretty sad. I, I did not expect that it's going to be the war or something like that. No one expected that. Really. And uh, when I lose my dad, it was so hard to me and my mom because we're just like two of us in the family. Like we can say we are alone, just me and my mother. Now given the opportunity to visit Rockford, Jamoslok jumped at the chance, eager to explore the city, providing them support. Because it's America, it's another continent, right? So I'm like, oh my God, I'm going to America and like Rockford, it's like so cool that I'm here. And I'm happy and there is so, so beautiful, that incredibly beautiful place and I love it. Ko Rovina sees the impact this is already having on the kids. Grateful for just a moment for them all to refresh. The children, they, uh, we see that uh, they smile, they, uh, they make jokes and etc. So uh, we are very happy to, to, be, uh, to be hosted uh, here and um, everyone I'm sure that uh, will return with uh, good emotions about uh, this visit to Rockford. The group will spend nine days here total, and anyone interested in helping enhance their trip can email brovery at rockriverymca.org. Back over to you, Brittany. All right, glad to see they're enjoying their visit, Emily. Thank you.